several transgender students have dominated high school track and field competitions in Connecticut for the last few years. And, once again, transgender teen runner Anne Tri Yearwood has topped most of the field in the state championships. Yearwood has been running for Cromwell High School in Cromwell, Connecticut, for the past few seasons, the Washington Times reported. But this year, Yearwood was not alone in topping the field. Indeed, two transgender students took the top spots in the Nutmeg State. Yearwood came in second place this year as transgender student Terry Miller of Bloomfield High beat Yearwood and the rest of the biologically female field of competitors. But, as the Times reported, some in Connecticut are objecting to the situation. We all know the outcome of the race before it even starts, it's demoralizing, biologically female teen runner Selena Sowell said. I fully support and am happy for these athletes for being true to themselves. They should have the right to express themselves in school, but athletics have always had extra rules to keep the competition fair. Sal's point of fairness was also recently raised by tennis great Martina Navratilova. The multiple Wimbledon winner said males should not be allowed to compete against females. No matter how many hormones they take or how much surgery they've had, they are still males born with a male's strength and physical traits, she said. Navratilova wrote a long op-ed revealing her feelings against transgender athletes being allowed acceptance under their chosen gender, calling the idea that men can compete as women insane and cheating. But her candor and considered opinion were too much for the gay advocacy group, Athlete Ally. Athlete Ally released a statement last week accusing Navratilova of being transphobic and adding that she has been removed from her advisory board and as an Athlete Ally ambassador, effective immediately.